Hi, my name is Stuart Merkin. Um, Dr. Galbit performed surgery on me, triple bypass surgery, exactly or a little over four years ago. And I've known Dr. Galbit for the last 30 years as a personal friend. And what happened with me personally was I'm very active. I bike, I kayak, I do a lot of different things. And there was a weekend a little over four years ago that I was feeling, uh, I thought it was indigestion and I simply didn't go out and I didn't uh, bike. My wife was very concerned, but it was just indigestion and I went out, I started biking and I didn't feel that well, I came back. So I, um, she became alarmed, went to a friend in the neighborhood, it happens to be a doctor, and we went up to uh, Aventura Hospital Sunday afternoon and we met with uh, Dr. Uh, Aldo Coelho, who's a cardiologist, who's now my cardiologist. I didn't know him before, but he was highly recommended by my friend. And they didn't let me out of the hospital. And I was there because of what I had. I was there for two weeks. And after I, they performed the surgery about five days after I was there. Dr. Galbert performed the surgery. It was, from what I'm told, although I didn't know while it was happening, it was a fairly serious operation. It was triple bypass surgery. And the hospital was great. Dr. Galbit uh, took care of whatever had to be done at the hospital, and I felt very, very comfortable. I don't think I would have felt as comfortable with any other surgeon. I know um, other heart surgeons, happened to have one in my uh, family and not in Miami and Dr. Galbit is highly recommended by everyone that I talk to. Uh, the follow-up uh, for the first couple of months after the surgery I had uh, you know the normal pains and so forth and I was um, not going out too much um, I, I happen to be a lawyer, and during the time that I was in the hospital, maybe I shouldn't have done it. I don't know that I ever told Dr. Galbert that I did it, but I was still pecking away on my computer uh, before and after the surgery, and some of my clients to this day didn't know what I was doing. Well, they knew what I was doing on the computer, but they didn't know where I was doing it and what happened to, uh, what happened to me afterwards. But um, the two or three months afterwards, Dr. Galbit followed up uh, meticulously and I come to his office now, I think it's every six months for a um, checkup. I'm out biking again, I'm doing my kayaking again and um, I, I mean I still feel certain things. I'm not saying that I'm pain free or anything like that but I still feel um, you know some pain where they opened up my chest to do what it was that they did. Um, I've been active, uh, I've been active in my profession, I've done a lot of things. Um, my wife and I are taking a cross-country road trip this week, so I guess it's okay. <laughs> they, nobody seems to mind, except the kids wonder, do you really want, our kids, do you really want to drive out here to L.A. and uh, in a car? And, you know, I did it a long time ago and I think I'm able to do it now. I don't think it's a real problem. My wife was great uh, taking care of me and the uh, post-op people that came around uh, took care of me but as far as motivation um, listen I have three kids and 11 grandchildren so that should be motivation enough and I have to work <laughs> so I'm out there and you know the doctors even my cardiologist every time he says to me, he says, oh, you're the one that doesn't like to admit what you really had. And I said, no, I call it, even my secretary says, you, you call it, you had your procedure. And um, that's how we refer to it. And I feel, you know, fairly normal. I don't know what's going to happen tomorrow, but I feel, you know, very normal. I've slowed down some. And it was a real wake-up call for me to slow down and, um, you know, enjoy the flowers. But 
Really, I, I never had a motivational problem afterwards. I, I went to um, rehab, you know, walking and doing all of these things, and I never really, I looked at that and I said, why don't I just go walking around the house? Why don't I just uh, walk around outside? But it really did me a lot of good. The, you know, there's a motivation that you get when you're walking because there's somebody there and checking your heart and doing all of these things. So it really makes a big difference, I think.